Hi guys, I'm uh, rebooting, and yes, I have now the Linux X4, well, Xenmod version X4, um, well, X64 Vivo 4, right? Um, thing is, yeah, I did it, but manually. So, next thing is maybe you can do this thing not manually. So, I went to xenmod.org. And I came across this line here, App Repository is the word to Google. And this is a what I like to have, right? So Control C. I'm gonna add to my Ubuntu chat WM. This is PPA. So it has there's logic in there, lo local stuff, just install. This is with PPA. That means let's put it just before Opera at the end. Let's do copy, control C. Control V, this is gonna be Xenmod, right? Save, that's that. Again, Control C, back here. So this is the first line. Let's see if we can improve the code maybe. So what do we get? This is Xenmod, go grab it. Pseudo T. And here the armor. So you see these guys have all different ideas of how to add it. And it's interesting to see all the diversity, right? So Xenmod, save, back in here, adding this, control C, that's the line. Control V. Okay, see the update. And yes, we're not gonna install anything at the moment uh, by default. Uh, otherwise, it would be something like that. So, version three, they say. We had version four somewhere. I downloaded it from SourceForge. But we could add this here but like I said at the clean install of after clean installation don't want it immediately but now I can if I have the key if I have the repository I can just type sudo app install Linux XML if I want to right save so this line control C is gonna add the key ring so yes, we work with key rings as well. Uh -huh. Sure. And then this one. Where is this one? That one. Control C. We add a file somewhere. Here, etc. Sources list D. Xenol release list. That's done. And this tells him that it's signed. And this tells him where it is and what the folders, one of the categories are releases and main. And now, if I sudo apt update, it'll get the extra lines in. That's the extra line. And then I can say sudo apt install Linux X. Voila, and we've got some choices. Version 4 is available for LTS as well, RT as well, and I guess the, the normal one. And that's the edge one 6.11 all right so that's um, a script that we have that you can make that you can copy paste and you have now the ability to just install whenever you like it when you see fit you install another kernel not the Linux kernel not the Linux LTS on Ubuntu what do we have apt install Linux tap tap so there are some stuff here, you have a look, AWS, Amazon Web Services, Azure, Beige, <laughs> here's some headers, All right, let's go down, can we do page down, yes, Linux headers there, virtual, Linux sign, so this is what we get, these are all the numbers, so sudo apps install 
Linux. LTS and L. Right. Nothing there. The Zen. Different names. And hardened. That's all. Acronyx. So Linux. 70 more rows. But now X. Send mod as well. All right. Cheers. By the by, I will push this up to Arclix Nemesis. So you get this code immediately in that file.